Kepler film is a great way to resequence, but you should always remember to watch the design stitch out on screen through the stitch player before sending the design to the machine. You may have more resequencing to do. During the last video, we made some changes to this design. We changed some colors, we changed the stitch order, we added a pink flower, and now we're going to watch the design stitch out. I'll click on the stitch player and I can bypass the stitching of the lettering. I want to get to the design to watch it stitch out. And the yellow on the left side will stitch out first and then it's going to come over and stitch the other part of the yellow. And now the blue stitches out, it bounces over here and stitches out the second design and then it comes back here. So we can resequence some objects to make this stitch out more efficiently. So I'm going to close Stitch Player and to change the objects, there are some other icons in Color Film that can be used. I will first click on Show Objects to activate the objects. And then I want to scroll down till I get to the blue area. This is also a good time to make the boxes a little bit smaller in here so I can see more of the color chips, or in this case, the objects. The first thing I want to do is locate where in this stitch sequence this particular leaf is stitched. So I'll hold down the Alt key and click on that object. And you can see that it is located here in the stitch sequence. I want to move this blue object to stitch right after this object that is selected right now. So now I'll hold down the Alt key and select the one that I want to move. Now there are actually two pieces here, so I'm going to have to hold the Alt and the Control key to select both of these pieces. And then I want to scroll up in Color Film so I know where these objects are because I want to place the selected objects right after these. So with these selected, I can click on the back one object and move it up in the sequence so that it will stitch after these objects. By moving that one object, this leaf now stitches right after this leaf, and I don't have to move that second object. Remember that the direction the triangle points in color film is the direction that the object or color will remove. So if I need it to go up in color film, I'll click on a triangle that points up. Watch the design stitch out again with the stitch player, and we can do this, we can speed through this, and you'll see that the design stitches out much more efficiently. And you're ready to save the design and send it to the machine.